Morning traders, 14th of March 2018. Crispin here from FX Algo Trader. Today we are going to talk about running the triple moving average crossover system with two moving averages, not something I would advise, and also using opposite cross exit in a touch based trading mode. Again, not something I would advise, but here we go. This is just really just to prove prove that the system is working okay in this in this setup. In fact, a customer pointed out that it wasn't actually placing touch-based trades in 2MA crossover mode, and they were quite right. I made a change to the code, and I'd edited out the global variable setting parameters for 2MA touch-based logic on the basis that I didn't think, well, my fault actually, I didn't put it back in, but no one else had noticed it because I don't think any of the other customers are using it in a 2MA mode. It's, um, it's not my favorite way to use it at all because using two, two moving averages doesn't take into account any trend filtering uh, at all. And that's, um, you know, just as an aside, I've back tested two MA crossover modes uh, quite extensively using strategy testers, and I've never seen a two moving average system which works profitably in the long term. So they they all lose money. Anyway, if you want to use it, use the system in a two moving average mode. Um, you know, I'm only here to provide software. Uh, <laughs> so. Here we go, we've got a couple of charts here, sterling US dollar, Aussie US dollar, one minute each. Um, we've got uh, the interface set up, we've got both cases, we've got opposite cross exit engaged. I'm running 0.1 lots, stop loss 20 pips, take profit 20 pips, minimum order interval one. I'm using four orders maximum. I'm using a one period and a five period MA, um, just because I want to trigger loads of trades. I'm using EMA as my method because the opposite cross exit logic uses EMA close parameters and unfortunately there's nothing you can do about that that's just the way the opposite cross exit logic is being coded I could harmonize the opposite cross exit logic with the method and the applied price that you set up I don't particularly want to I don't like opposite cross exit logic very much it's a bit ugly uh, particularly when it's used in touch based modes it's, it's kind of gets quite confusing in terms of working out what the hell is going on <laughs> um, so I would be tempted not to do to run the system in this way I, I'd be personally running three MAs using um, market adaptive components um, like the MA deltas um, to take me into really idyllic dip buying or rally selling opportunities okay so yeah so we've got some some possible possible cross ups and downs going on we've got um, some trades being triggered here as you can see let's just have a look at the experts tab and we saw here at uh, 927 that's uh, three minutes ago we had an opposite exit close have we had anything recently probably but anyway, hopefully you can see the system working. The key thing really, if you're using opposite cross exit logic, there'll be a one in the first digit of the order code, and that means it's engaged. You cannot change the opposite cross exit logic post trade. So it's got to be set pre trade, so you can't turn it off once it's engaged. So, so these trades will close if we get an opposite exit on any of these charts. So we can have a little look, see what's going on here. So we are short sterling. So if we get a cross up here, it needs to go possible cross up. Is it going to close our trade for us? Yeah, it did. Um, it's you know it's clunky. As I said, you know this this logic, this trade logic here is ugly because it's sh really short term stuff the MAs are all over the place and it's it can get pretty confusing as you can see i mean this is this is a mess here so again you know it's not something i'd advocate but anyway it's just it is what it is so thanks very much for watching i've i've updated some some of the um indicator and ea parameters so to allow um crazy trading you know it will be available in the license management area Shortly. Thanks for watching.